Hello everyone, this is Yolanda and I'm back again with a really quick video. I just wanted to show you what I made for myself um, over the Valentine's Day weekend. I called it the self-love and self-care weekend. I really took some time out to like relax and focus on me, which you really have to remember to do. Um, self-care is really something that I have struggled with throughout my life well throughout my adult life I should say just remembering to take time to breathe and realizing that everything doesn't have to be accomplished at the same time and um, just making sure that I am putting my well well-being and happiness first so that I'm able to accomplish the things that I want to accomplish so on Valentine's Day weekend I did a few things to um, you know make some space for myself that's what I, I think I'm gonna call that's what I'm gonna call self-care and self-love from now on making space for yourself also showing up for yourself so I did like uh, a face mask um, I bought me two bottles of wine, a red and a white. I watched movies, I journaled, I read, and I made myself a piece of jewelry. So I made myself a bar necklace and on one side it says carefree. And on the other side, uh -oh. it says magical hopefully you can see that so um, if you are familiar with the I guess trope sayings I'm not sure what the exact word is for the phrases um carefree black girl magical black girl i definitely have taken to those phrases and really identify with the need um i wrote a whole post on the carefree black girl black girl as a minimalist that's how i interpret that phrase being carefree means simplifying your life focusing on experiences over things um taking risks and taking risks and not being afraid to go for what you want and letting go of things that you don't really need so that's how I interpret the carefree black girl um, for myself um, the carefree black girl is a minimalist and then for the magical black girl for me that speaks like directly to my creativity <clears throat> and the ability to not only create things with my hands physically because I love you know making things and crafting but also my ability to create and shape the life that I want so yeah I really identify with those two um archetypes for black women so last weekend I made myself um this necklace um that's it you know it was valentine's day weekend so i thought i'd give myself a piece of jewelry i am single and happy about it but um i still like to you know as part of my self-love and self-care journey um you know give myself a gift so i've really been enjoying this wearing this necklace and you know i flip it around depending on what mood i'm in and it's really like an affirmation for me. Like sometimes I have to remind myself um, to be more creative, to think outside the box, to honor the magic that's within me. Or sometimes I need to remind myself to stop trying to complicate something or stop trying to take something so seriously um, and just be in the moment. So yeah, I just wanted to share that with you. 
um what did you guys do over the valentine's day slash self love slash self care weekend share with me below you know what you did um if you hung out with friends with your significant other if you spent time alone um tell me how it went and how you honored and loved yourself and other people thanks for watching peace